Hi, I'm Dr. Bertice Berry, and I want to tell you a story. Long ago, long, long, long before most of our people, our ancestors, came to America, Native Americans roamed the land. They would go out and hunt for everyone in the village, in their tribe, in their community. And all the, everything that they got, they would bring it back and share it with everyone. And then one day, um, new people started coming. And someone said to the tribe, why is it that you share everything? You're the one who caught the most. You have the most of everything. You should get the fattest meat. And so that person said, what are you talking about? They didn't know this concept of taking yours first. They thought you brought it back and you shared with everyone. They said, no. In our tribe, the one who does the most gets the most because they're smarter, they're better, they have the most. And so they said, yeah, you're right. So they said, I should get the most. And then over time, the elders and the young people, the weak and the frail, would get sick and would die because they didn't have everything they needed because they couldn't go out and hunt. And this is how Wetiko, the spirit of Wetiko, begin to infiltrate the land. It's the spirit of greed. Today, the day after Thanksgiving, the day we give thanks for everything that we already have, the day after we go out and try to get all the things we don't even need. Wetiko, greed. Take a deep breath in, let it out. And the only way to really counterbalance that, if that is that if enough people, not many, just enough, the critical mass, something like seven to 10% would avoid that, would decide I have enough, I am enough, I can do more with what I have. If we were to decide that we would share what we have, continue to share what we have, speak up for those who are marginalized, um, and begin to restore true justice, which is righteousness, in the land, we can re prepare this breach that happened through the spirit of greed, Wetiko. It's a big, long story, and it spans decades, it spans generations, but I think we are the generation that can set things right. I am so grateful for you. I am so grateful for you listening to these stories. I'm grateful to those of you who share the stories. I'm even grateful to you who try to steal it, make it your own. Uetiko. Mm. I am grateful because I know that truth ultimately wins. God wins. Love wins. We all win. I love you.